common mechanic business day for a hundred three sex worker. I was a sex worker and here's how I found the unconditional love of a lifetime. So he she is a sex worker. It didn't matter for a Calcutta Bay surgeon name that girl he was falling in love with had a stigmatized and horrific past. He saw Sulekma name his co-worker in the factory as someone who was brave enough to fight her circumstances and remodel her life. Suleka, who was forced into prostitution at an early age, was also betrayed by her own family and abused mercilessly at hands of her former employer. She found it hard to trust anyone, but Sergio waited patiently for a year until she finally came around in 2015. Today, they are happily married with a four-year-old son, breaking away from social stigma and discrimination that is often intertwined with the daily lives of former sex workers. The couple are an epitome of what true love can concur. They spoke to the couple about what it means to break stereotypes in a society filled with regressive mindset. Though she had left the hotel, the emotional scars and nightmares stayed with her for a very long time. It became impossible to trust anyone, including her employers at the new factory. She tells me every time a man looked at her on the street, she would walk faster. And most days, she preferred staying inside the shelter. So it's like, even if you have this past, still, you still have the chance to find a true love. Thank you.